Yes, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Goals Bible. KG here. This is your match reaction. Italy 2, Belgium 2. Look, it was a, an incredible match. Incredible match. I mean, the first half, Italy was in cruise control. They were winning this game by two goals from Cambiasso's and Rategi's. But then the sending off, the sending off, I think, completely changed this game. Uh, Pellegrini got sent off uh, around 45 minutes with a ridiculous tackle. 41 minutes, 40 minutes, ridiculous tackle from behind. And he was sent off. And immediately after that, the Cypher has scored for Belgium. And then the second half, I mean, it was all Belgium. It was all Belgium. And they deserve to get that equalizer through Trossard. But fascinating game, fascinating game. I'm going to talk about the game in a little bit. But let's quickly take a look at the standings as things stands right now. Italy with that draw 2-2. They've gotten seven points. They are up top. France has just beaten Israel 4-1 today. So they are second with six points. And Belgium will be third with four points. And Israel zero points out of three games. So it's going to be between France, Italy, and, and, and Belgium to see who is going to advance to the next round in this competition. But look, if you take a look at it from the table perspective, a draw is not a bad result for Italy. But if you look at the, the game's perspective, Italy should have won this game. They should have won this game. I mean, if they did not get that red card, they would have won this game comfortably. In 24 minutes, they were leading this game by two goals to nil. And Belgium just had no answers, no Kevin De Bruyne, no Lukaku. You're thinking they're going to struggle here, Belgium. And they were struggling in the first 20 minutes. But then the sending off it just completely gave them hope. It gave them some sort of belief to come back and get a result and that's exactly what they have done and they could have won it they could have won it i mean this referee has been really awful in this game uh two penalties he has not given one for italy and uh at the end and before that there should have been a red card for uh bastoni as well rash challenge from behind uh openda was was through on goal and that should have been a penalty for Belgium as well. So two penalties he has not given. You might say that even things out, but in the end, look, awful, awful decisions has been made in this game. But eventually these, these referees, I don't know what it is anymore. Like, are they doing it on purpose? Or is it an accident? Is it a mistake? I mean, VAR did not even take a look. They did not even take a look at the handball that uh, Italy should have gotten near the end. But look, it is what it is. Let me know your man of the match. Who is your man of the match in this game? Let me quickly ask the question in terms of who is the highest rated player in the Silver Score app. You guys let me know in the comment section. Whoever gets that answer, you know you're gonna get uh, you're gonna get points. So let me quickly ask this question now. Who is the highest rated player for Italy? Let me know in the comment section. So if you get it right, the first ten people will get pen, uh, ten points each. So yeah, but yeah, guys, uh, thank you for watching. Look, let me know your comments and thoughts about this game. And what do you think happened in this match? Should there have been a red card? Should there have been another penalty for each of these two teams? Let me know in the comment sections. But yeah, guys, thanks for watching. And I will see you guys uh, on the next stream. Bye. Peace.